Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. Canada stands poised to participate in an international endeavor, spearheaded by the Czech Republic, aimed at financing the delivery of substantial quantities of ammunition to Ukraine. This commitment entails a proposed investment of 30 million Canadian dollars, equivalent to approximately 23 million US dollars, to facilitate the urgent dispatch of artillery shells to Ukraine. The initiative was unveiled during the Munich Security Conference, where Czech President Petr Pavel delineated a strategy to gather up to 800,000 shells of varying calibers, encompassing those meeting NATO standards as well as those sourced from non-NATO nations, necessitating financial assistance for their transit to Ukraine. Defense Minister Bill Blair affirmed Canada's engagement in dialogue with the Czech Republic and the signing of a Memorandum of Understanding pertaining to the potential procurement of munitions. The objective is to expedite their availability to Ukraine while enhancing Canada's own production capabilities. This endeavor aligns with Canada's ongoing commitment to fortify Ukraine's military assets, which includes the provision of hundreds of drones to bolster the war effort. While some of Canada's allies have expressed reservations regarding the country's potential reliance on external munitions production via the Czech Republic, potentially to the detriment of its domestic manufacturing capacity, Blair hinted at forthcoming announcements regarding investments in Canadian munitions production. The pressing need to augment munitions manufacturing has been underscored by Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky's acknowledgement of a munitions shortage contributing to the withdrawal of Ukrainian troops from the strategically significant city of Audiuka. Delays in international aid, notably exemplified by the current impasse in the U.S., Congress over a substantial military and economic aid package for Ukraine, have exacerbated the shortage. The Czech initiative, aimed at procuring munitions from non-NATO countries, has prompted behind-the-scenes deliberations among EU defense ministers and encompasses proposals for substantial procurement to address Ukraine's requirements. This initiative reflects broader concerns regarding the pace of munitions production among NATO allies and underscores the imperative of sustaining unwavering support for Ukraine in the face of Russian aggression. That's all for now. See you later.